You alright guys? Going to be uh, doing a little unboxing for you today. As you can probably tell because the title already says what it's going to be. There's no point going back. That's what we're going to be unboxing today. Um, as you can probably tell. Got it from Amazon. It's the uh, Samsung Galaxy S3 in... I think it's called Marble White. I think, I think I'm right saying that. It might not be. Got a big old knife out here. Get this thing. Oh god. Move this thing out of the way because it's rattling about. Amazon. Very small box that the actual device comes in, but that's the way Samsung do it. So what I'll do, uh, yep, you can see that, you can see that marble white. See if it's going to focus. Oh, pardon me. I'm filming this on my new camera, by the way. It's a Panasonic HXWA10, I think it's called. Could be wrong, probably am. So, what we'll do? Slip that seam open. Do the same there. Move Stabby out the way. the lid off for the first time and uh, wow well, looks very nice let me zoom in a bit for you so you can see HD AMOLED Super AMOLED quad core Bluetooth and FC yeah this is the first time I've actually seen a Galaxy S3 in the flesh and this very <laughs> it looks a lot nicer than the pictures when it first when they first uh, showed off the Galaxy S3 in London um, I was watching the stream and thought oh dear that just looks it looked terrible but now actually looking at it get all this crap off no one likes that chuck that down there it actually looks really nice feels good in the hand am I missing any? No, just the screen one so yeah, I'm going to put that to the side for a moment. Let's see what else we get in the box. We've got warranty card. Quick start guide. GT i9-3000. i9300, sorry. Um, Mark USB. Come on. Anyway, yeah, micro USB to USB charging and sync and data transfer cable. This nice little. Uh, look how white my arms look. Jesus Christ, they're not that white in real life. Well, they're still very, very white, very pale, but not as bad. And so the uh, Samsung UK charger is quite handy. You uh, you flip it in, and then. When you're travelling, you need more space. Come in down, and it goes to like that. Quite handy. I quite like it. Um, got some nice earbuds for different size ears, which is cool. Which is nice with Samsung. It's a nice feature. Um, headset with a. Uh... Come on, focus, you piece of crap. Come on. I don't know what's going on with this camera. Maybe if I zoom in, it'll focus. There you go. Volume up and down, and uh, end call, answer call button. These are quite these are good, quite good quality actually. A lot better than the ones that HTC give. Um, but I've got my own headphones anyway, my own in ear. And then the battery here. 
which is a nice big twenty one hundred milliamp hour battery, which is very good. Hopefully this will last quite a while. Anything else? No, that's it for the box. I'll move that all out to the side. Bring the actual device back in. A bit more zoom there. A little bit less maybe. There we go. Okay, so let's get this battery unwrapped. Move that over there. Get this back cover off. I feel it's extremely light without the battery, and the battery is not very heavy, so I can tell it's going to be a very light device. So where is it on the side, like the Galaxy Note? No, it's on the top. Well, we'll go through the phone actually first. Right hand side, you've got the power button or lock button, wake button. Down the bottom, we've got a mic pickup. It's focused on the battery for some reason. Move that out of the way. I'm going to try and get some focus. This camera's not very good, is it? Come on! Anyway, you got the microphone port, micro USB charging port, the left hand side volume rocker, feels quite nice. On the top, 3.5mm headphone jack, and another microphone. On the back, LED light, um, 8 megapixel camera, and the speaker, and then nice plastic back. On the front, obviously, front facing camera, a couple of sensors there. Uh, we've got the one hardware key down here, a uh, menu and back, I think, and then you know, speaker grill. And then on the front, obviously, 4.8 inch Super AMOLED HD, 1280 by 720 resolution. Um, through the specs of this, you've got a quad core 1.4 gigahertz, I think it is, Exynos CPU. This has been a bit of a bastard to get off. So the thing you don't want to pull it too hard, you don't want it to snap. Oh, bloody hell. There we go. Yeah, core core CPU, Exynos, um, one gigabyte of RAM. We've got 16 gigabytes internal storage, micro, micro SD card slot, which is great. Um, micro SIM card as well. 2100 milliamp hour battery, like I said. I'll shove that in there right now and uh, yeah 8 megapixel camera Android 4.0 with TouchWiz 5 I think it is we'll see how that does um, should I put my SIM card in now mm, yeah I might as well I might as well put my uh, using my Galaxy Note at the moment because that just got the actual official 4.0 update only yesterday I got it so it took its time to come, but it's there. So it is my little. It wasn't actually, it was just a normal SIM from Orange, but I just got a micro SIM adapter. I think I'm going to have to take the battery back out. Give you some information about the device there. It goes in like that. I don't know how you're meant to actually get the SIM card out once it's in there because there's not really anything to get it out with unless you sort of ah it's got a nice little um, like a spring loaded thing down here so you can push it in and it locks in and then push it in again and it pops itself back out that's quite cool that's handy good boy Samsung that's the way you do it Obviously, user accessible battery, which is great. HC One X doesn't have that. Neither does it have a micro SD card slot. So, uh, yeah, that's uh, pretty much it for the unboxing. I'll do a uh, first impressions video, maybe maybe later today, but probably tomorrow to be honest. Um, and then I'll be doing quite a lot of videos compare it with the One X, the iPhone 4S, the Galaxy Note, the Galaxy Nexus um, even the Sensation XL which I've got lying around somewhere but uh, thank you for watching 
and uh, I shall see you next time. Ta-da.